Okay, good morning, afternoon class. So today our lesson is taken. We continue dalam unit four, which is wild weather, tentang cuaca yang uh, teruk. So we continue in page thirty six. Page thirty six. Are you ready? Okay. Okay, page thirty six. Are you ready? Let's start. Okay, still in about still about weather ya class hold on ya class let me just slightly increase the font size okay we're still talking about weather okay what is the meaning of weather cha cha okay we're still talking about weather <clears throat> i think i changed to which color we try green today is it better nope green is not better it's almost Hmm, maybe yellow. Now nah, I think red color is the best. Yep. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. So. So right now, we are going to read some of this thing. We're gonna read. Okay. And then after that, kita akan baca dulu. Lepas tu kita akan pilih yang mana tajuk yang paling sesuai. Which title is the most suitable title for this text? This few texts. Okay. So I'm going to read and I'm going to explain. Yeah. So you just listen. Yeah. But before that, we're going to look at some of the titles first. Kita tengok tajuk-tajuk ya. Dia ada kasih tiga kerana dia nak kamu pilih yang uh, yang mana tajuk dia yang mana yang mana ialah tajuk ya yang mana. Okay. I explain the titles. Let's start with the first one. Okay. Unlucky, lucky itu bernasib baik. Un maksudnya sesuatu yang sebaliknya. Jadi unlucky bermaksud tidak bernasib baik. Okay, unlucky students. Okay, pelajar. Okay, unlucky students, pelajar pelajar. What happened to them? They spend their night. They spend night in classroom. Spend night maksudnya spend maksudnya menghabiskan. Okay, night di sini ialah masalah. Waktu malam menghabiskan waktu malam dia di classroom di classroom di dalam kelas. Maksudnya dia tidak dapat balik. Okay, kenapa kita tahu dia tidak dapat balik? Why do we know that uh, the the students uh, couldn't go home? Can you see the eyes? Okay, can you see on the picture eyes? And then here is road. Okay, close. Apa maksud road close? Jalan ditutup. Maksudnya kerana terlalu banyak uh, salji dia ni. The snow is like maybe they have a problem regarding the snow. Okay, so the they cannot, they couldn't go home. Mereka tidak boleh balik. Okay, let's look at the second one. Local, local ialah tempatan. Girls, satu orang saja ya. Kerana ini girls. Apostrophe S. Ini bermaksud punya. Apostrophe S bermaksud punya. Jadi, satu orang saja. Okay. Local girls. Foto sukses. Sukses ialah kejayaan. Foto ialah gambar. Jadi, uh, perempuan atau uh, wanita tempatan. Okay. Kejayaan gambar maksudnya kejayaan uh, dia, dalam kerjaya dia sebagai Juru gambar as a photographer. What is juru gambar in English? Okay, juru gambar in English is photographer. Photo is gambar. Grafer ialah orang itu. Jadi orang yang mengambil gambar, we call it photographer. So she is a photographer. Okay, dia seseorang juru gambar tentang kejayaan dia sebagai seorang juru gambar. Her success as a photo. Let's look at the third picture. Schools close. Okay, sekolah ditutup. Okay, why ditutup? As blizzards continue. Kalau kamu ingat apa itu blizzard? Okay, kalau kamu ingat apa itu blizzard? Okay, blizzard. Okay, there's no internet connection. Okay, blizzard is. Hold on, class. Okay. 
blizzard is this one. Kalau kamu masih ingat. Okay, maksudnya uh, salji yang sangat-sangat teruk. Teruk sampai mereka tidak boleh keluar dari rumah kerana sangat berbahaya. Okay, we learned this in our previous lesson, right? Okay, so blizzard continue kerana blizzard ini masih ada blizzards. Okay, so sekolah ditutup mereka tak payah pergi ke sekolah. For example, right now because of COVID, because of COVID cases meningkat increasing setiap hari every day increasing ialah meningkat setiap hari every day schools are closed same thing we all <coughs> we all is we all um, the schools in malaysia are closed because of covid whereas this one the schools are closed because of blizzards maksudnya mungkin uh, apa itu storm uh? Uh, maksudnya saji yang sangat-sangat teruk lah. Okay, saji turun dengan sangat teruk sampai mereka tidak boleh keluar daripada rumah. Okay, so let's look at some of the texts. Let's read the first one first. Let's read at number one first. Okay, are you ready? I read and you look at your textbook. I read and you look at your textbook. Or you look look at the screen or so can listen to how I pronounce. Dengar macam mana cikgu sebut perkataan-perkataan ini. Okay, are you ready? So let's start. Number one, students and teachers at Grange, Grange, okay, secondary school. Okay, you guys are now in secondary school. Apa maksud secondary school? Sekolah menengah. Okay, if people ask you, which school do you go to? You can say, Balong Secondary School. Okay, so, students and teachers of Grange Secondary School in the village, village ialah kampung, apa nama kampungnya? Of Hepworth near Dundee, Dundee. Cikgu nak tahu macam mana sebut, okay? Kerana nama, nama tempat were unable. Apa maksud unable? And unable means tak boleh. Okay, tak boleh. Unable, okay. To get home. Get home maksudnya balik rumah, ya. Last night, okay, semalam. Let me just crease this. Because heavy snow... Kerana snow ialah salji, salji kan. Heavy ialah yang banyak. Bukan berat di sini ya. Eh. Sini bermaksudnya salji yang banyak. Was blocking the road. Okay. Blocking the road. Terus ialah jalan. We just learn just now. Jalan raya. Blocking ialah. What is blocking in BM? Ah? Okay. Block in BM is. Um, uh, tersekat. Okay, jalan telah tersekat. Tersekat oleh apa? Tersekat oleh snow. Because of the heavy snow. Snow yang terlalu banyak sampai orang tak dapat memandu di jalan raya. That's the meaning of uh, heavy snow was blocking the roads. We had to sleep. Kita terpaksa tidur on the floor di atas lantai. Okay, it wasn't tidak very, tidak sangat comfortable apa maksud comfortable comfortable selesa selesa it wasn't very comfortable said 13 year old Jamie okay Jamie Banks her name is Jamie Banks okay but it wasn't all bad okay tidaklah semuanya teruk tidaklah semuanya teruk okay The teachers let us, okay, cikgu-cikgu let mem, uh, membenarkan, bukan sini bukan membiarkan, sini ialah membenarkan, let us play games on school computers, okay, play games on school computer menggunakan komputer sekolah. Jamie added, okay, jadi Jamie tentang, dia bercakap tentang heavy snow was blocking the road. Itu ialah keyword dia, okay, heavy snow was blocking the road. Snow yang terlalu banyak sehingga jalan-jalan raya tersekat, tidak boleh lalu. So, I give you 30 seconds, kamu fikir yang mana ialah title dia yang uh, sesuai dengan ini. Which title is the most suitable one for text number one? I can't until 10. You can pause the video, okay, you can pause the video. The answer is this. 
unlucky student. Heavy stone was blocking the road. Okay, jalan tersekat. Okay, mereka uh, mereka tinggal di classroom. Okay, yeah, sleep on the floor. Mereka tinggal di dalam uh, lantai. Lepas tu mereka bermain dengan komputer sekolah. Maksudnya mereka tersekat di sekolah lah. Roads closed, jalan raya tutup. So picture number one is for text number one. Okay. Next one, let's look at text number two. This is text number two. Okay. I see. The word I see ber- ber- datang daripada perkataan I see itu. Uh, sini ialah I salji ya, ber- berujuk kepada salji. I see condition. Okay. Condition ialah keadaan. Keadaan yang uh, berais, maksudnya banyak salji, was still causing problem. Okay. Masih causing menyebabkan problems masa a la all over seluruh all over seluruh country negara seluruh negara maksudnya tempat negara mereka semua berdipenuhi dengan saji. However, tetapi however in north of England. North ialah, kalau cikgu tak silap, ialah utara. Okay. Utara England, in north of England, some students were celebrating. Mereka meraihkan sesuatu. Apa yang mereka meraihkan? Celebrating ialah meraihkan. Let's see what are the, uh, what were they celebrating about? When their school was called, kerana sekolah mereka ditutup. Okay. Itulah mereka celebrating, merayakan schools. Their school was closed because of bad weather. Kerana cuaca weather bad dia lah uh, buruk. Cuaca yang buruk. This is great. Mereka cakap sin- sangat seronok, sangat bagus. Macam kamu sekarang kan, kamu seronok kalau sekolah ditutup. Betul ke tidak? Now I can go. Now I can go. Saya boleh pergi main snowballs. Snowballs ialah ini. Cikgu tu setuju ke- ke- kepada kamu. Mereka guna um, salji tu snow to make into like a ball shape uh, snowball. Okay. Buat kepada macam macam snowballs. Macam... Ni ni yang guna salji untuk buat macam bola-bola. Okay. So. Dia cakap saya boleh keluar main snowballs with my friends. Said Jessica Watson. Uh, eight years. Uh, at a uh, year eight. Year eight ialah mungkin macam. Aku tak tahu. Lain mereka punya itu. Darjah ataupun tingkatan dengan kita. From Durham. Okay. This one. Which one is the answer? You say. Schools were closed. Which one is the answer? Schools were closed. The answer is this one, right? School closed as blizzards continue. Maksudnya, uh, masih ada masalah salji-salji. I see condition. So, the answer for the third one, the uh, second one is the third picture. Okay? And the last pic- uh, text. Let's look at the last text. Okay, text number three. A student from Mortimer School, okay, a student ialah pelajar, what is the name of the school of his or her, I don't know whether it's a, oh, it's a girl, yeah, of her school, her school is Mortimer, the name of her school. Conventry has come first. Come first bermaksud bukan datang pertama. Come first di sini maksudnya tempat pertama. Okay, tempat uh, yang pertama. Okay, tempat pertama dalam apa? In a national photography competition. Uh, competition. Apa maksud national? National ialah dalam negara. Negara itu fotografi ialah tentang gambar. Okay, maksudnya uh, teknik, uh, maksudnya bergambar. Competition ialah pertandingan. Maksudnya dia men, uh, dapat tempat pertama dalam pertandingan, competition, fotografi, mengambil gambar national. Dalam negara ini, dia nombor satu. Okay. Salah satu daripada competition. One of the competitions. Salah satu daripada pertandingan mengambil gambar. Okay, so who is that person? The the the, the person. Oh, it's a girl. No wonder. Okay, kalau kamu tengok di sini girl kan? Girl mestinya biasanya dari 
kita say like dari satu tahun sampai biasa 18 tahun atau 17 tahun ber, bergantung kepada undang-undang di negara itu biasanya 18 lah okay, lepas 18 kita panggil tidak panggil girl or boy sudah kita panggil mungkin lady or man or uh, perempuan muda uh, yang lady yang man kita guna yang maksudnya mereka tidaklah dewasa sangat tapi dewasa yang lebih muda sikit okay? yang lady yang man yang man okay So, you say girl kan? Jadi, maksudnya lebih kecil daripada 18 tahun lah. Kebanyakan masa begitulah maksud dia. Okay? So, how old is the... Who is the person and how old is she? She is Lucy Preston, 14 year old. 14 years old. Okay? Use mobile phone. Gunakan dia punya mobile phone. Okay? To take her winning photo. Mengambil gambar menang dia. Maksudnya gambar ini yang menyebabkan dia menang. Okay. Take her winning photo of a, apa gambar dia? Of a frozen lake. Lake ialah tasik ya. Frozen ialah sudah beku. Okay. Tasik yang beku in what? In winter. Apa maksud winter? Musim sejuk. Musim sejuk. Malaysia, we do not have winter in Malaysia. We only have um uh, rainy season and uh, hot season okay we just have like this hot season throughout the year okay what is she going to do apa yang dia akan buat apa yang uh, going cikgu, ingat cikgu ajar going bermaksud akan okay going to do akan buat with her berapa dia punya price price ialah hadiah ialah 500 pound benda ini ialah pound ya okay Not ringgit ya. Yeah. I'm going to use it. Okay, I'm going. Saya akan use it guna to buy beli camera. She laughed. Okay. So the last picture for text number three is this one. Okay. Obviously, this is an answer because she is talking about photo success and she is a little girl. Not little girl. I mean, fourteen year old girl. Okay. Okay. Uh, so right now. Okay, hold on, ah, class. Hold on. Oops. Okay. Hold on, ah. Okay, so sekarang kita ada tiga orang. Siapa tiga orang? We have three per people in this uh, text. One is Jamie. Okay, for the one who's talking uh, about winning a photography uh, competition, her name is Lucy Preston. And the last person here is about the one that is shocked dia sekolah ditutup boleh main snowball, Jessica Watson. Okay. So right now, kamu boleh buat nanti, lepas kita habis lesson ini, kamu boleh buat soalan ini dalam Google Form. Soalan yang mana? These questions. These questions. Okay. Read the article and answer the questions. You say, who said that he had fun in a difficult situation? Okay. Had fun maksudnya seronok dalam difficult situation. Situasi yang... Susah. Dia berseronok. Kamu fikir, kamu tengok yang mana antara tiga orang tadi itu. ya. Ini kamu pilih jawapan kamu dalam Google Form. Won something. Okay. Nombor tu won dalam pastin untuk win. Maksudnya menang. Pastin untuk win. Menang sesuatu. Number three. Felt happy gembira when she heard terdengar some news. Uh, ber, uh, sesuatu berita. Plans to spend some money. Okay, plans di sini ialah berancang. Spend menggunakan some money. Okay. And the last one. Didn't expect to have a holiday. Didn't expect. Tidak expect menjangka to have a holiday. Mempunyai 
uh, uh, cuti yang mana yang tiba-tiba mereka ada cuti punya okay so dari tiga orang ini kamu pilih jawapan dia Jamie Lucy Preston and Jessica Watson okay answer these questions on the Google form okay on the Google form ready so right now we're going to do listening okay we're going to do listening let me change the gambar dulu ya class let me just change the gambar let me change the picture i uh, let me change this yes okay so right now cikgu kasih kamu dengar dulu i let you listen to the audio kamu cuba teka perkataan-perkataan dia akan membaca kamu cuba teka dan dengar dan tulis perkataan yang dia sebutkan 2 3 4 5 6 7 lepas tu round kedua cikgu akan jelaskan dan ber, uh, beri jawapan okey so the answer for let's listen are you ready kamu dengar dan kamu tengok apa perkataan yang kamu putut tulis di sini yang yang blank yang empty di sini yang kosong di sini okay and then round kedua cikgu akan beri jawapan dan jelaskan i'm going to give you the answers and explain ready okay start now in the news exercise three Start now. Today, it is very cold in Scotland, the north and south of England, and in Wales. Snow is falling, and there is deep snow lying in some parts of the country. It is more than one and a half metres deep in some places. There are blizzards in the south of England. The heavy snow has made conditions on the roads very dangerous and many trains are not running. Some roads are blocked by snow while other roads are very icy. The police have asked people not to travel by car if their journey isn't important. Twenty people spent the night in a local sports centre when blizzards on the M25 motorway closed the road. The weather will get better tomorrow, but it will remain very cold until the weekend. Okay. You can repeat. Kamu boleh repeat. Cikgu takkan repeat. Okay. Uh, kamu boleh repeat tadi. Kasih rewind dia. Dengar lagi kalau kamu tak mau dengar jawapan dari cikgu dulu. Okay. Okay, ready? So, you can pause the video. Kamu boleh rewind. Kamu boleh balikkan video audio ini, video ini, lepas tu buat lagi. Sebelum kamu dengar penjelasan, before you listen to my answer and my, okay, jawapan-jawapan cikgu. I count until five. One, two, three, four, five. Today, it is very cold. Okay, hari ini sangat sejuk in Scotland. Scotland ialah di UK ya. Yeah? The north and south of England. Okay, bukan saja di Scotland tapi also north. North ialah utara, south ialah selatan of England. Scotland ialah satu negara berbeza. England ialah negara yang berbeza. Tetapi mereka sama-sama membentuk UK. Okay, kamu, cikgu tak mahu jelaskan ini ada tidak seberapa complicated tapi tak seberapa penting untuk kamu tahu sekarang. Okay? And in mana lagi sangat sejuk? Just now you say, we, kita sudah pernah belajar perkataan ini di in unit number 2. Wales. Huruf besar lah kelas kerana ini nama tempat. Wales. Wales. Okay? Big, uh, in capital letter, capitalize in big letter because this is a name of a place, proper noun, kata nama khas. Okay, let's continue. Snow is falling, salji tengah turun, and it, there is a deep snow. Snow maksud salji yang sangat dalam. Maksudnya 
tebal sudah salji mereka tu memang banyak teruk betul salji mereka okey lain lain maksudnya banyak salji lah tapi fikir maksud lain sini in some parts of the country okey di in some some ialah setengah part ialah bahagian country negara ini banyak dia punya salji sampai betul-betul sangat tebal sudah banyak betul it is more than lebih daripada tadi dia cakap one One and a half. Satu point lima. Tapi kalau kamu dah tahu, kamu sep, kamu spelling. Dia cakap one. Lepas tu dia cakap N. Setengah. A. Half. Setengah. Meters. Kalau lebih daripada satu. Satu point lima sudah kan? Lebih dari satu kan? Jadi meters dia perlu tambah S. Meters. Okay. Cikgu tulis bagus-bagus lagi. Okay, jawapannya ialah 1.5 meter setengah lah, daripada 1 meter. So, the answer for number 2 is 1 and kalau dalam exam listening begini kamu dah tahu kamu tulis saja yang kamu dengar. 1 and a half meters. Kerana lebih daripada 1 jadi meters dia perlu ada S. Kerana 1.5 sudah lebih dari 1. Ni Perkataan berbeza ya kelas. Jarakkan. Next. There are blizzards. Again, we see the word blizzards. Maksudnya, salji yang sangat-sangat banyak yang teruk. In some in the south of England. Okay. Selatan England. The heavy snow. Snow yang banyak betul. Has made, made ialah menyebabkan conditions, okay, uh, kondisi, situasi on the road di atas jalan raya, very berbahaya. What is the word? Okay, the word is dangerous. Dangerous. This is all, ya. Yeah? This is all. Next. And many. And many. Are not running. Bukan berlari di sini. Okay. I, I give you the answer for number four. Okay. The answer is. Trains. Apa maksud trains? Trains ialah kereta api. Okay. Not running. Tidak berlari. Bukan kereta api tidak berlari. Di sini bermaksud kereta api tidak Uh, beroperasi tidak uh, operasi dalam BM ialah uh, ada satu beroperasi sebenarnya tapi kita tengok apa lagi apa kata yang dia boleh guna untuk maksudnya tidak uh, kereta api itu tidak ber, tidak tidak, tidak, tidak berjalan lah okay tidak beroperasi Some roads are uh, block, okay, jalan raya, block, we just learned the word, disekat, disekat by what? By snow kerana salji, disekat oleh salji, while other roads, ad, okay, other roads adalah jalan raya yang lain, are very, okay, are very, okay, banyak ais kita panggil tadi, we just learned the word just now, banyak ais kita panggil, I see, the road, The roads are icy. The roads are icy. Jalan raya itu penuh dengan salji. Next. The police have asked, okay. Polis sudah tanya people to not travel by car. Okay. Polis, pihak polis sudah ask, menyuruh ya. Okay. Menyuruh orang not, tidak travel by car okey ma maksudnya ber, ber menggunakan kereta lah maksudnya keluar dari rumah menggunakan kereta lah if their journey isn't important kalau dia punya perjalanan itu tidak penting maksudnya urusan kalau tidak penting jangan keluar dari kereta ini dia punya maksud ayat ini okey sorry Okay, 
twenty people dua puluh orang spend the night. We just learn the word spend the night. Bukannya menghabiskan malam, maksudnya mereka menghabiskan waktu malam di. Okay, itu maksudnya. Maksudnya mereka tidur di tempat itu. Okay, kita baru belajar tadi kan. Sekarang kita ulang lagi. You spend the night, bermaksud dia tidur di sesuatu tempat. Okay, spend the night in a local local. Just now we learn tempatan local what. The answer means if you listen carefully, the answer is spots. Spot ialah sukan. Center ialah... Apa center dalam BM? Ha? Tiba-tiba cikgu nak tahu. Center. Dalam BM ialah pusat. Pusat uh, sukan. Maksudnya pusat orang bermain sukan lah. Sports. Center. Mesti ada S. Kalau dia dalam bentuk adjektif. Sports perlu ada S. Kalau dia bentuk adjektif ya. Next. When blizzards on M25 motorway. Motorway macam kita uh, highway tu. Tapi kita tak ada highway kan. Highway kita kecil. Macam highway yang banyak tu. Yang besar di KL tu. Tu maksudnya motorway. Orang UK panggil motorway. Kita panggil highway. The M25 motorway close the road. Kerana motorway um, uh, M25 ditutup. Tak boleh balik. Mereka highway ditutup. Okay, jadi mereka tak boleh balik. Itulah mereka spend the night tidur di local sports center di pusat sukan itu. Okay, last paragraph. The weather will... The weather will menjadi lebih baik. Get better. Menjadi lebih baik. Get better. Will get better tomorrow, but it will. Dia akan remain very cool. Akan menjadi sangat sejuk. Remain ialah kekal. Very ialah sangat. Cold ialah sejuk. Until the weekend. Sampai weekend. Sampai hujung minggu ini. Okay. So, your homework for today is only to answer this question. Part 2, 5 soalan dalam Google Form. Okay, kalau tak faham, baca balik lagi ini untuk kamu supaya kamu boleh jawab soalan dalam Google Form. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you, class.